The Labour Court has handed embattled Nairobi Speaker Beatrice Elachi a reprieve, setting aside an order prohibiting her from presiding over house business. Now, the order serving as a temporary measure of a sanity in a county where the Assembly and the Executive appear on autopilot. And as our very own Sam Ogina reports, the Executive make that Governor Mike Sonko's antics of threats and intimidation have seen five cabinet reshuffles and over 50 cabinet officers either suspended or sacked. It is a reprieve for Elachi who was unwanted by a group of MCAs allied to Majority Leader Abdi Guyo. The MCAs wielding a court order barring Elachi from overseeing the Assembly's proceedings. But the Labour Court has reinstated her. The court order was subject of friction that saw chaos reign during Tuesday's opening session of the City County Assembly. The Assembly split with one faction supporting Elachi and the other faction demanding for her ouster and preparing for a fresh stab at impeaching her. The bad blood in the County Assembly, just a mirror of the bigger problems Nairobi County faces. Yeah. Nairobi County has been reduced to a one-man show running the country's biggest economy. Governor Mike Sonko has gone without a deputy governor for nearly two years since the resignation of Poli Kapigade in January of 2018. The two simply never clicked. Since coming into office in 2017, Sonko has either sacked or suspended more than 50 county officials. The most notable such decision coming in April of 2018 when 30 officers from the county's procurement department were suspended for inflating prices and issuing local purchase orders without approvals. The suspension of 16 other officers in September 2019 following the collapse of Precious Talent Academy that killed seven peoples was Sonko's second largest decision of that nature. All the officers were replaced a week later. Among those replaced is Charles Kerich, a one-time blue-eyed boy of Sonko's administration. Sonko has effected several other suspensions and sacking of his officers, decisions undertaken on the spur of the moment. During his reign, the county chief has reshuffled his cabinet a record five times in the two years he has been in office. With his cabinet made of ten dockets, only six of his cabinet executives have escaped the sack or suspension. They include Devolution's Larry Wambua, ICT's Newton Munene, Winfred Gadangu, Agriculture's Pauline Kahiga, Education CEC, Lucia Mulwa, and Trade Executive Alani Gambi. The flamboyant governor once moved operations of the county to his Mua home in Machakos County. Sonko then claiming his life was threatened by the Interior Principal Secretary Karanja Kibisho, who he accused of trying to meddle with the affairs of Nairobi County. With the suckers from the executive and a ruckus from the assembly, Nairobi City County, the country's biggest economy, stares at uncertain times. Samogina Citizen TV, Nairobi.